Hi friends, this is Nagashwa. Welcome to my channel IT Part 143. In this tutorial, I will show you how to use Mail Merge in Microsoft Office Publisher 2007. Open Publisher 2007. We can use Mail Merge when we want to create large number of documents that are mostly identical but include some unique information. And also to create individually customized publications with personalized notes. And we can also use Mail Match to create a product announcement that we are sending to our prime customers. In this, the text of the publication is always the same, but the name and address are different for each customer. Here, I'm selecting letterhead template. We can customize the letterhead by selecting new color scheme and keeping it as default and click on create. Now we got the letterhead. I want to add some text in this letterhead. We can use the mail match task pane to guide us through the steps for creating a mail match. To open mail match task pane in a new existing publication, come to tools menu. Navigate to mailings and catalogs. Here we can create mail match for letters, labels, postcards and envelopes. And we can also do email match and catalog match very easily. I'm selecting mail match. Mail match is made up of three parts. Creating recipient list which contains a list of names and addresses. Preparing the publication with merge fields and creating the merge publications. Let's create recipient list first. The recipient list may be the Outlook contacts list or list prepared in Excel worksheet or text files in which tabs or commas separated the columns or paragraph returns separate the rows. If you have already prepared the recipient list, select the option and use on existing list or you want to select the names from Outlook contacts, please select this option, select from Outlook contacts. If you don't have an existing list to connect to, we can create a new list by selecting the option type a new list and then click on next, create or connect to a recipient list. In the new address list dialog box, type the information for the first entry in the relevant fields. Not mandatory to fill in every field. We can use tab to move between the fields and shift tab helps to go back to previous fields. Let's enter the recipient information. And to create second entry, click on new entry. Again, fill all the information. After typing the recipient information, click on OK. In the save address list dialog box, type a name for the address list in the file name box. and select a locational folder in which to save the list. By default, Microsoft Publisher saves address list in the My Data Sources folder in My Documents. It is the best place to keep the address list here because this is also the default folder in which Publisher looks for data sources and click on Save. And all of the contacts in our new list appear in the Mail Merge Recipients dialog box where we can filter and sort the list of the recipients to include in the merge. And also we can select the recipients that we want to include in the match. Select the checkboxes next to the recipients that we want to include and clear the checkboxes that we want to exclude. And after this click on OK. And we got the address list to proceed into the next step. And we need to prepare a publication using this recipient list. Click on the item that we want to show. And it will create a text box by showing that item drag it and place in the suitable location. Now let's zoom this. Here I want to add a greeting line before the first name. Dio and add comma or semicolon after first name. If we click on first name, it will show a small dialog box with some shortcut options. And we can also insert the names in the data. And in the top, I want to add the contact address, including first name, last name, address, and contact number. For that, click on first name, space, last name, enter, company name, enter address one, address two, enter, city, state, zip code, 
and phone number and let's format this now I want to make first name and last name into bold and also I want to add background color to grab the people's attention now come to mail merge dialog box click on the arrow to preview the recipients mail merge combines one document containing the information that is the same in each copy and some place folder for the information that is unique to each copy we cannot edit our data source entries on our publication pages but we can format move delete the data fields to find and preview a specific entry in the data source click on find a recipient in the find field please type a recipient name and also enter the search criteria after that click on find next and it will directly jump into that recipient information page and after this we can also add few more items like picture field, address block, greeting line and address fields after we complete mail merge publication click on next create merge publication in the mail merge task pane under create merged publications we can print our merged publication and preview our merger publication to see how it will look before we print and use space up and down options to go to other recipients and click on close we will come into the mail merge task pane and we can also save the merged publication for later use publisher creates a new publication with the merger pages and we can save this publication in the mail merge task pane please enter your file name and select the type and after that click on save click on close to come to original position and we can also add the merge pages to another publication if you plan to add our mature pages to the end of an existing publication make sure that our mail merge publication matches the existing publication in page size page view publication type and page order let's click on add to existing publication on the desktop I have created a letterhead publication I'm selecting this click on OK and it is inserted merger pages to the end of an existing publication but remember one thing that publisher adds merger pages to a new or existing publication but cannot add them to an open publication if the publication to which you want to match is open be sure to save and close it before you complete the match and we can also save this publication and to go to virtual publication click on return to virtual publication or simply click on close again we will come into mail merge task pane and also we will get few more options we can print the recipient list to track the mailing and we can also save a shortcut to this recipient list for use in a future match and also create a copy of the recipient list as a new file and we can also jump into the previous widget setup to correct the errors like this we can use mailing match in Microsoft Office Publisher 2007 I hope you like this video if you like this video please click on like button and please share this video with your friends and please visit my channel ITBot143 to watch more latest uploaded videos and don't forget to subscribe my channel thank you friends have a nice day